kids, your mother and I are going out to a movie, except the movie isn't for kids so I called Julie to babysit you too. Yay, Julie is coming to babysit us. You egg, I don't want Julie, she always pitches on me. Well too bad so sad, we are hiring Julie and that's final. Come in. Kids, say hi to Julie. Hi Julie. Hi Tommy. Oh, uh, oh, 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 Rosie, how dare you call Julie a dummy? That's it. You lost strike one. By the way Julie, the kids have three strikes. As you just heard, Rosie has two strikes left. Alright Mr. Anderson. Okay, we will be heading out right now. And Rosie, do not misbehave, got it? Yes, I got that. Okay, good. Bye kids, see you in two hours. Bye dad. Okay, so what do you kids want to do right now? I want to watch a movie. Alright, what movie shall we watch? I want to watch 2010 Karate Kid. Okay, and what do you want to watch Rosie? I want to watch Money Life. I'm sorry Rosie, but that show is for grown-ups. Why don't we watch 2010 Karate Kid? I want to watch Money Heist. 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 Rosie, how dare you throw a temper tantrum over a TV show? I'm giving you one last chance before you lose your second strike. Julie, I'm feeling hungry. Okay then, why don't we go to the kitchen and I will cook something. What do you want to eat, Kalu? I think I will have macaroni and cheese. Alright, what do you want, Rosie? I want pizza from Peter Piper Pizza. I'm sorry, Rosie, but your parents told me not to take you two out to eat, so I guess I will be making macaroni and cheese. Do you want to help, Kalu? Oh yes, I do. Do you want to come along, Rosie? I'm fine. Okay then, but you better not change the movie, understand? Yes, Julie, I understand. Okay then, let's go kill you. Yay, they are gone. Now time to activate Play Watch Money Heist. Why did I hear gunshots and screaming? Kalu, did 2010 Karate Kid have any of that stuff? No Julie, 2010 Karate Kid didn't have gunshots. It may have screaming in it, but no gunshots. Wait a second, Rosie must have changed the movie to that TV show she wanted to watch. Uh oh, I've got to switch it back to Karate Kid. Uh oh, I can't seem to find the remote. Why don't you confess before I look at the TV? Bum, 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 bum. All right then, let me have a look. Oh, 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 oh. Rosie, how dare you disobey me? That's it, you just lost your second strike. Now to change the channel back using my universal remote. I'll she changed it back. Whatever. Rosie, food is ready. You egg, where do I freaking have to freaking eat mac and freaking cheese? This is what we made Rosie. Why don't you take a seat and eat? No, I asked for Peter Piper pizza, not for this yellow thing. Rosie, calm down and eat your food. No. And you know what? I'll bring the food to you. Oh, 
Rosie, how dare you throw a plate of mac and cheese at my face. That's it, you lost your final strike and you know what that means. Oh, how convenient, I just got a text message from your parents and they will be home shortly. Meanwhile, you will be standing in the corner of the wall in the TV room. Kids, we are home. Huh, what did you do this time Rosie? I will tell you all about Rosie. So basically, Kalu wanted to, to watch a movie. He wanted to watch a kid friendly movie but Rosie wanted to watch an adult show. Kalu then got hungry and the both of us went to the kitchen to stir up some mac and cheese. Then Rosie switched the movie to the R-rated show. That was her first strike lost. Her second strike lost was when she got angry that we made mac and cheese instead of getting pizza from Peter Piper Pizza. Then she threw the plate at my face. Well things will get ugly, so I advise you leave. And for having to put up with Rosie's bullcrap, here is $50. Okay good, have a good day Mr. and Mrs. Anderson. Rosie, you done with? Come here right now. Rosie, Rosie, Rosie. How dare you misbehave while Julie was here? That's it. You're grounded, grounded, grounded until time machines are invented, which will be never. Go to your room now. Wow. I just traveled back in time and came back to present day. I just got a disturbed feeling that time traveling just got invented.